Shalom. First and foremost, I want to give all praise, glory, and honor unto Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Harakak I want to give a double honor to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone that rule well. And I want to also say to say a sincere Shalom unto the hopeful elect that are scattered throughout the four winds of the earth, unto the true servants, the prophets, the men that are prophesying and laboring in this truth and in this doctrine. Unto you, I say Shalom. What do all the chip deniers say about this? And I'm going to play this video right here that came out uh, recently about the first patient of Elon Musk's Neuralink and how you're going to see it, how he's able to control things like the cursor, his computer, and all this stuff with a chip in his brain, all right? And I say the chip deniers because you have a lot of Israelite groups out there that teach that the mark of the beast is not the microchip, all right? Excuse me. And as the closer and closer we get to the end of this thing, all right, the end of this man's society, they're going to push this device on the world. All right. And this guy right here, this this uh, this droid. All right. His, his brain going to be fried. All right. By the end of the year. All right. I think I did a lesson on him where they said the new the whatever the electrodes on his brain, 85 percent of them detached. All right. But this this is this pseudoscience that this devil pushes forth. All right, out there to deceive you, you, you dumbass people out there. All right, that tr that trust and believe in this man and the technology. But you got a lot of Israelites out there that are bought and paid for by the so-called white man Esau that'll tell you that what it says in Revelation the 13th chapter, it's not this, it's not this device. So let me play this, and then I'm going to bring out some pre precepts. And the closer and closer we get, these guys that have, you know. That that have uh, really denied uh, 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 the truth. All right, really, you denying this truth, this major prophecy. You're denying your Habashi Shmuel Shai. At the end of the day, so let me play this. All right, it's only fifty-two seconds. The demonstration yeah. of what you can now do. Here we go. This is uh, the link app. This is how I control everything. Um, this is the app that they've uploaded um, onto my computer that lets me control the cursor. Um, this is my devotional that I've been reading um, all the time, uh, every day. And then this is me playing chess. Well, wait a minute. So, you're moving the cursor. You're moving the cursor, Nolan, just by thinking about where you want it to go, or is it your eyes? Uh, no, it's it's just me thinking about wherever I want it to go. Oh, man. So yeah, you're not so, even tracing it with your eyes. You're, you're just looking at it. And no. Esau is going to present this as something futuristic something uh, uh um you know uh, uh innovative he's going to present this to all to the world all right to each demographic of people he's going to attack to you know to for them to you know uh, uh take hold of this technology all right and you got israelite groups out there that are teaching that this device is not the motb and they'll say oh well it says buy and sell well I'm pretty sure if he can use his brain to do all this other shit, he can do his brain, use his brain to purchase something. All right. To use his brain to, uh, 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 um, to, uh, um, yeah, to purchase something in the store, to purchase something online. All right. To make, uh, uh, uh financial transactions. All right. I'm going to play the rest of it. It's only what, uh, 14 seconds. I can move it and I can move the cursor around, whatever I would like to do. Um, I don't have to be staring at it at all. I mean, it's it's amazing. There's not even words to describe. Yeah, there's not even words to describe how amazing this tech is. Yeah, they say, and they, we'll, see, we'll see if he's saying that in about six months. All right, to a year. All right, when when his, when his brain, you know, is is uh is turned into jello, probably. But let me start with Isaiah sixty-two and six. She's sixty-two and year six. I have said, Watchmen upon thy walls, O Jerusalem, which shall never hold their peace day nor night. Yea, they make mention of the Lord Yahweh, keep not silence. And that's a true prophet of Yahweh Shai. When the truth comes out and we see uh, um, this neural link and different technology, we bring it forth. All right. The true watchmen are not going to be silent. The true watchmen are not going to uh, be settled on their leads. The true watchmen are going to tell the people the truth. All right. So at the end of the day, they got the blood off their hands. There's no, you know, oh, maybe it was this, maybe it was this. Ain't no maybes. Ain't no ain't no gray areas with the Most High. Is he, let your yeas be yea and your nays be nay. Yes or no. All right? And, and, and you got a lot of Israelite groups out here that are, are that are that, that 
this shit is coming out, all right? The cat is out the, out the bag, all right? Esau, they're bringing forth this technology, and they ain't go, and they not they not slowing down, all right? Um, let me jump back to Isaiah fifty six, and uh, verse ten. His watchmen are are blind; they are all ignorant; they are dumb dogs; they cannot bark, sleeping, lying down, loving to slumber. All right, those are the those are the false prophets out there that are telling our people the wrong thing, that are not bringing giving our people the, the proper warning, or are not sounding the alarm, all right, are not bringing forth this truth in its entirety, all right, are giving the people 98, 99 percent of the truth. But this MOTB is a major prophecy, all right. It, it, it's, it's a lot of these guys sold out, all right, and they have large congregations that that you know. They believe everything that, you know, leaders like Nate say, all right? The bishop. This is Micah 3 and 11. The heads thereof judge for reward. All right, actually, let me see. Wait, verse 10. Um, hear this. I'll read now. Hear this. I pray you, ye heads of the house of Jacob and ye princes of the house of Israel, that abhor judgment and pervert all equity. They build up Zion with blood and Jerusalem with iniquity. The heads thereof judge for reward, and the priests thereof teach for hire. The prophets thereof divine for money. Yet will they lean upon the Lord and say, is not the Lord among us? No evil can come upon us. And that's what they're thinking. All right. They, they have these large con congregations. They have a large following. They have all these views. They have all these followers on YouTube and social media platforms. And they're not giving you the proper warning there because a lot of them are bought and paid for. A lot of them are compromised. All right. All these chip deniers. All right. I want I want to I want to know when as Esau continues to bring out this technology and, and you can't hide from it anymore. It's no denying it. What are you going to say? What are you going to tell your congregations? OK. And it boils down to they're not they're not occupied with prophecy. This is a major prophecy. All right. This uh, neural link shit. All right. Uh, um, this is Sirach Ecclesiasticus 39 and 1. But he that giveth his mind to the law of the Most High and is occupied in the meditation thereof will seek out all seek out the wisdom of all the ancient and be occupied in prophecies. You have to be occupied in these major prophecies. And the MOTB is one of the major prophecies that's coming that's coming up or right, that keeps keeps popping up in news. Neuralink this, cashless this, pay with this, pay with your palm. All right, it's not, it's, it's Esau's not hiding their agenda anymore. All right, and the true prophets are going to give you the the uh, the, the the righteous warning. All right, whether you may like it or not. All right, this is what's going to happen. Everything is going to be um, attached to this 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 central database attached to a RFID chip. All right, I just say it. You got a lot, of, you know. I want, I, and I'm, one, it's closer and closer we get, what are all these chip deniers going to say? All right? You, you know, it, it ain't going to be a joke anymore. All right? It ain't going to be when, when your job tells you, hey, this is a new technology we're, we're enforcing, we're implementing within our system. It's going to be, you know, it's going to make everyone's job easier. What do you do? All right? Because your whole life after, up to that point is going to be tied to this man's system. Your job, your your your, your car. All right, your, your way you, you know, uh, everything, your, your job, your home, all right, how you pay your rent, your mortgage, it's going to be tied to this man's system. What are you going to do? All right, and, and if a lot of these guys, a lot of these groups, they're not teaching their congregation what it is, they're not prepared, okay? The men of GMS, we're prepared, all right? We know what it is, okay? We know the technology behind it. We know that it's going to be a test to everything. So we have to be prepared and are preparing ourselves to give up everything. All right. Uh, let me go to, the, let me go uh, hit Revelations, Revelations 13. All right. Uh, Revelations 13 and verse 15. And the thing about this technology is what they're doing is they're 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 um they're presenting this there it's, it's like a snowball effect all right where you know um you know they're they're presenting information you know um 
you know, slow, you know, kind of slowly and, you know, putting out things like this. And eventually it's going to be mainstream. It's going to be like the new iPhone. OK, the, the new smartphone, the new, you know, uh, iPad or whatever, whatever the latest technology. This is going to be, you know, and, and they're, like I said, they're going to attack each demographic of people. All right. They're going to, you know, attack the attack, uh, attack those that are um, maybe maybe uh, 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 don't have use of all their extremities. All right. Where they can use, you know, uh, uh, you know, uh, um, you know, they can, you know, it's going to seem like they, this is something they could use. It's something that's going to make their life easier. But at the end of the day, we know it's going to destroy a lot of lives. A lot of people are going to take this. And this is just one, this is just one, um, you know, demographic of people they're going to attack. All right. They may, you know, they're going to use so many of their wicked devices to attack, uh, you know, uh, 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 attack the public, attack, you know, the people where they want to take it willfully before it's forcible. Okay. Before Esau got to get their hands dirty and, um, you know, uh, 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 make it mandatory. All right. This is the uh, book of Revelation, chapter 13 and verse 15. And he had power to give life unto the image of the beast, that the image of the beast should both speak and cause that as many would not worship the worship. The image of the beast should be killed. All right. And that's literally and being cut off from society. All right, you went, you know, you're not able to, you know, you're pretty much killed off from 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 society. Okay? You're banished, you're put in exile because you can't make any transactions, all right? You you denied uh, uh that image of the beast, which is one world government, one world um uh, currency, one world um health, okay? Uh, um one world uh, uh you know, of course that they, they got to throw the LGBT and all that in there. All right, it, it, uh, democracy, all these wicked philosophies um, that Esau is going to bring forth and, and, and you know, um, under this new world order and present to the people. All right, verse four, verse 16, and he causeth all, both small and great, rich and poor, to receive a mark in their hand or in their foreheads. All right, and where's this CHIP? Where's this chip at? In this guy's head, and he's able to control things. And that no man may buy or sell, save he had the mark or the name of the beast, or the number of his name, okay, so, hey, this guy is, you know, I don't think he's gonna make it till then, you know, till this shit's made mandatory, he's nothing but a guinea pig that Esau's using right now, and, you know, they're gonna, you know, they're gonna use all their wicked devices, of course, uh, uh, uh to their advantage, but that, that's, that's what we get, into. that's what we get into, so all you chip deniers out there, Continue to not deny that the, the, the chip is the MOTB, all right? And, and the closer we closer we get, you're going to have to make a choice. You're going to have to make a choice to basically teach the right doctrine or, you know, get ready to catch a missile or, 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 or get chipped up with you and your congregation, okay? Because if you're not teaching the right thing and you know it, all right, you, you're going off. All right. And, and the Lord is going to the Lord is going to judge you greater than he's going to judge those that you led uh, uh, to that slaughter. All right. So Lord, within this lesson was edifying unto the elect. And I want to give all praise, glory and honor to Yahweh Hashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Harakakwadash. Shalom.